reward, nothing ventured, nothing gained. Jacked up and good to go. The entertainment title in the following video is rated M for mature. You have been duly warned. This video is not for children or the faint of heart. Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Fulcrum and welcome back to Burial C Episode 2. Now, let's get back into the stealth action. I needed to find the Suchong. Silver Fin looked like the best place to start. My tongue feels weird. All right, here we go. Hold on. How do I switch ammunition again? Effects are being a bit. Hold on, what's going on here? That would be too cool. Okay, don't crash on me here. There we go. Little speaker. It's him. It's the big daddy. The one that killed me. You can't trade blows with him. Comstock put him down and he got right back up. Now I can't hurt him. I can keep him. Not the one we got. Hand cannon. Distance, but if I watch myself, he can come in handy. Enemy of my enemy. because it seemed fashionable? Or did you intend to make something of yourself? If you don't keep ahead of the rest, you'll be resigned. Okay. Compromise. 
Optimizing the fun. The shoe fits. You got me. No. How do I? God. I am literally trying to remember how to switch weapons. Not weapons, ammunition. Okay, then what use? F. Fire weapon. Switch weapon. Gameplay menu. There we go. So we got across the tranquilizer pretty cool. Hmm. Looks like someone's been decrypting the hole. Suchong has some likely to give it up easily. They've confirmed completion of the ace in the hole. Suchong has it, huh. but unlikely to give it up easily. I wasn't expecting to see we'll this. Update when we know more. What's that all about? <laughs> You're against a guy making an honest buck. I thought Rapture was open for business. They're, they're cracking open. My memories of the future and, and, and somewhere I'm going to go. You sure it's your future you're looking at? If not mine, then, then whose? That's a very good question, isn't it, Elizabeth? Mother of Mercy. Okay, this is... Oh, this game is determined to give me a heart attack. Okay, cool. Sometimes I think you've taken this whole Robin Hood business a bit too much to heart. 
Vitae's got us out there ladling soup for the purpose of building an army. Not to share the milk of human kindness. You keep up this kind of behavior. I'm gonna start thinking there's more red in you than Karl Marx. What? The hell? Splicers. Busting me! Hurwitz! Tell Vitae the perimeter is compromising! Put on your rubbers. Seems to be knocking them back. You're only gonna do real damage. That way, if they don't see you coming. I got what it takes. Nah. I'm out. Okay. Explain what that was. All right, so we're here. Thank you, honey. Oops. That could be bad. Louie, 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 Louie. Hey, if you don't get down here soon, there's not going to be an ounce of booze or a piece of ass for the taking. Uh, something oh, like okay. taking this whole Robin Hood business a bit too much to heart. Fontaine's got us out there ladling soup for the purpose of building an army. Not to share the milk of human kindness. You keep up this kind of behavior. I'm going to start thinking there's more red in you than Karl Marx. What? The hell? Splicers. Busting me! Hurwitz!
exceed my quota. Well, I mean, all, all, all right, all right, I was only off this much. Can't you kind of fell up right for once? <sighs> okay. First, the law gets bribery. Then, they want some belly in my privy, advising how I defecate. What's next, martial law? Okay, I finally have a shotgun. that for a dollar. Headshot. <gasps> All right. Okay, so 
managed to hit her in the head. Oh. That annoys me, I never even saw those. Two months as his disciple, trying to get a line on his trafficking ring. Awful man. Why not just kill Comstock and be done with it? Comstock had to know why. He had to know that he deserved it. Did he? Oops. Did he deserve it? <coughs> I suppose we all do. One way or another. Welcome to the circus of value. Radar reach. Yes. I got a nose maker out of it. Nice. Oops. <coughs> so it does look like, uh, Splicers come to populate the areas where we knock people out. Let's get the heck out of here. Daylight and gold dollar for you, sure. Now to remember where the big daddy is.
right up there. Message. Attempt to retrieve Ace in the hole from Su Chong unsuccessful. Ryan Private Security killed three of our men in the bargain. Okay. We'll need to explore alternate means of obtaining Ace. Test drive. <laughs> Knew it. I'd love to have children. Three at least. Of course, I need to find my fellow first. Well, he's strong and handsome, and smart and self assured like Andrew Ryan. And self aware. This fella Atlas has been making the rounds down here, trying to bring some kind of order to this pit. All the splicers think the man walks on water, but something about him smells stink to me. Reminds me a bit of my former employer, Frank Fontaine. Always talking about how he was going to lift Rapture right out of the old man's wallet. No fuss, no muss. See where that got him. What do you want? Let me in. I'm working with Atlas. I ain't heard nothing. Nobody gets you there without a contract, <coughs> my boss. Okay. Hey, another tranquilizer bolt. restaurant when I first came through. Now it belongs to this Su Chong. Looks like I'm not the first one who tried to get in here. Well, at least he left a trail.
Hmm. Well, seems like central heating came from this room, so it would stand to reason that the duct work should be <coughs> suit jobs. Su Chong wasn't exactly a master of subterfuge. No, he was a scientist. Thank you everyone so much for joining me today. <coughs> I've been Mr. Fulcrum, and as always, have fun, leave sadness behind, and no matter where you go, there you are. See you guys next time. Thank you.